Hi everyone, I'm here to review Creamy Red Pepper with Smoked Gouda Campbell's Glow Soup. So this is a package and it's as big as an average female hand. So we're going to turn it around and look at the nutritional label. It says here, serving size 1 cup, servings per container 2. Most people eat this entire package in one go, so it's basically you have to double everything. So in terms of calories, you're going to get about 500 calories, and saturated fat is at 45%. And if you eat this entire thing, you double it, you're actually taking in 90% of your saturated fat in just this soup for the day. For cholesterol, it's the same. It's 20% and sodium is 33%. So if you have a problem with sodium or fat or cholesterol, I would not recommend this soup for you because if you're going to eat this entire thing, which you will in one setting, and this is 45% saturated fat, 20% cholesterol, and 33% sodium, it's not that healthy for you. Nutritionally, vitamin C is 25%, which is pretty good. Vitamin A is 20, calcium is 15, and iron is 4%. In terms of actual ingredients, the ingredients tend to be really healthy. There's water, which is the main ingredient. Fire roasted tomatoes and tomato sauce, cream, roasted red peppers, the cheese, and, and, and all these other extra things added, like garlic puree, sweet basil, sugar. So it says here we basically tear, we microwave for two and a half minutes, and we remove it by grabbing on these little indications. This is where you grab it. It says the cool touch, you grab it there to prevent yourself from getting burned. You see the extra soup is right here, you grab it here. So you won't get burned because the indication is that this package will be very hot when you microwave it. So I'm going to microwave it for two and a half minutes. I'm going to cut the video and then I'm going to, the next video is going to have, um, the next scene is going to have me opening the soup so you can see what it looks like. Hi everyone. So we heated the soup for two and a half minutes. It says here tear to, tear to here for, to bend before heating. So you actually have to open a little bit before you heat it up. And then you heat it up for two and a half minutes. You grab it here because here it's actually really hot. And I'm going to pour the soup into my plate and see what it looks like. So it's really easy to put in your plate. It's not messy at all. And this is what the soup looks like. It looks like a creamy tomato soup. Now in terms of taste, what this soup tastes like, it's a creamy red um, tomato soup. It has spicy undertones and you can taste the, the cheese in it. It has a few vegetables in there. You can see the sweet basil. It actually tastes really good. I actually really like it. It's like a spicy, cheesy tomato soup. I wish it was a little bit thicker in terms of like ingredients. Like I wish it had more vegetables. But it's creamy. You have to a little. You have to like go like this a little bit so it doesn't. Otherwise, you're gonna have some sections that are a bit watery. But it's good, I like it. So, if you don't have a problem with your health, if you don't have a problem with cholesterol or sodium, I do recommend this soup. But, if you're watching your diet, and this is 90% of your saturated fat, then you probably shouldn't buy this. So, thank you for seeing my review.